you could take it away from all the others and it would be by itself powerful. What's up, everybody? You're listening to the Hustle and Flow Chart Podcast with your boys, Matt Wolf and Joe Fear. Speak a little bit more on Unity because this is the newest principle. So what sparked Unity as making it into the book as one of the, the seven now principles? You know, part of it was just looking at what's happening in society right now, that we are tribalizing, we're balkanizing, we're finding ourselves in membership groups that we identify who we are. And that identity, if it is shared by someone else, really causes us to feel very positively toward that person, to want to cooperate with that individual, to trust that person more, to agree with that person more, and the research shows to say yes to that person more. So it really does deserve something separate from mere similarity. So for example, one of the things we say produces liking It's just showing people that you have similar tastes or preferences or styles. This is not about similarity as much as it is about belonging together. That I am of this group that this person shares an identity with. Uh, Here's an example from a study that was done on a university campus. But outside on the campus, uh, researchers had a young woman about college age, dressed like a college student would, stand on a heavily trafficked part of campus and ask for donations to a good cause. I think it was the United Way. And she was getting some kind of response. But if for half of the people who passed by, she added one more sentence to the request. The sentence was, I'm a student here too. I'm one of you. Donations increased by 450%. This isn't something small. This is a big lever of influence. Where you have shared identities, they can be local identities, members of the same community, for example, or neighborhood, or even in in the Olympics, the nation. You know, when, when we're against the others and we're Americans, we really wanted those people to win. So anyway, those shared identities, those senses of shared belonging make a big difference in whether people say yes to us or not. Do you think there's going to be any additional principles added in the future or do you think it's pretty locked in at seven? Are there like other things that you're, you're, you're sort of paying attention to? You know, I'm not going to say no to the possibility, but it took a long time for me to figure out the principle of unity was really a separate principle. It wasn't just something that undergirded the success of all the others. That if you had unity, then scarcity would work better for you and and social proof would work better. No, no, this was, you could take it away from all the others and it would be by itself powerful.